Hello, my friends, and welcome to today's video break. Psalm 34, 4 says, I sought the Lord, and he answered me. He delivered me from all my fears. Whoever thought that David had fears? There's a process in this, in this passage that I think, I believe, is worth repeating, and maybe you need to write it down. There was a way that David, what, what happened in sequence here, and, you know, it's, it, it's a testimony. It's David's life. And he, I like Psalms because a lot of them is David, but he's expressing his interaction with God, his daily life with God. It wasn't just his weekly life. I'm talking, he, this guy lived daily, but here's what he did. It's a simple process. The first thing he said is, I sought the Lord. I, you know, but seek first his kingdom and his righteousness and all these things will be added unto you. Seek God. You know, <clears throat> we can run to many places with our troubles and heartaches. We can run many places with our fears trying to find answers, but there's nothing, nothing like seeking God with the place that you have trouble, that you have hurt, that you have pain, that, you know, you're, you need answers. Seek God. That's what David did. And he said, second step, this isn't up to you. This is up to God. And he answered me. Now God answers you know, prayers in all different sorts of ways. When we seek him, though, we leave the responsibility up to God on how he's going to answer our request. And so for seeking God for deliverance of fear, you know, sometimes we have to walk through the fear to be delivered of it. Sometimes God just takes them all in of himself and allows you to be free instantaneously. I don't know how God's going to deliver you, but I do know that we can't be delivered unless we're asked, right? Well, I can't say that because I can't limit to what God can do. But here's the process. You seek, and then the next job is God's job. Step two is God answers. God hears. God listens. God bends his ear to your request and to my request. And then he said he delivered him. Wow, friends, do you need delivered? Is there something that's so heavy in your life that if God could take it from you, wow, that'd be good stuff. Maybe the, maybe the sin of fear. Maybe realizing that you are more than a conqueror through him who gives you strength. You know, our, God has an amazing way of, of turning our focus when we seek him. He hear, we, we begin to hear the truth. And the truth is what sets us free. The truth is what takes us from one place with God to the next. It delivers us. It, it, it implants truth deep within our hearts. So I'm not sure what David heard. I'm not sure what God said to him. But I do know that we can't hear God unless we're seeking God. And if you have something that you would love for God to carry, take away from you, I just have to ask a question. Here's the process. Are you seeking? God hears you, child, when you seek him. There's no father. My, you know, think about approaching your father and him ignoring you. God does not ignore you. He hears because he's listening when you seek him. Be my, be, be, be blessed. I was going to say, I don't know what I was going to say, but be blessed, my friend, as you see God.